The following question was asked in the UPSC Civil Services Preliminary Examination 2023 under the topic of biotechnology. It reads, Microsatellite DNA is used in the case of which one of the following? Options given were A. Studying the evolutionary relationships among various species of fauna. B. Stimulating stem cells to transform into diverse functional tissues. C. Promoting clonal propagation of horticultural plants. D. Assessing the efficacy of drugs by conducting series of drug trials in a population. And the correct answer is, option, A. Studying the evolutionary relationships among various species of fauna. Let's understand why this is the correct answer, and what microsatellite DNA actually means. Microsatellite DNA refers to small sequences in our genetic material that repeat over and over again. Think of them as short patterns of letters, usually just two to six letters long, that appear many times in a row in our DNA. For example, a pattern like CA might repeat 10, 20, or even more times. These sequences are unique to individuals and can differ even between closely related species. That's what makes them so valuable for studying evolution and relationships among species, especially in wildlife biology, conservation, and even forensic science. Now, let's break down the key characteristics of microsatellite DNA. Highly variable, these DNA patterns vary a lot between individuals. This makes them excellent for identification, like a biological fingerprint. Short and repeating, they're made of short sequences that are repeated many times, like ADATAT or GCGCGC. Found throughout the genome, they're scattered across all of an organism's DNA. Easy to study, scientists can easily read and analyze these sequences using a method called PCR, which is like photocopying a tiny DNA sample to study it better. Applications of microsatellite DNA include Understanding how species evolved and how closely they are related, which is the correct answer here. In forensic science, to identify people from tiny bits of DNA, such as in crime scenes. In wildlife conservation, to track the genetic health of endangered animals like tigers or elephants. In agriculture, to breed better crop varieties by studying plant genes. In the context of India, microsatellite DNA has growing importance. Conservation efforts like Project Tiger use it to study gene flow between tiger populations in fragmented forests. The DNA Technology Regulation Bill aims to manage the use of such genetic tools in legal and criminal investigations. Agricultural institutions like ICAR use these tools to preserve and improve native crops and livestock breeds.